In this video, we'll talk about what's included in the affiliate program agreement. We will talk about the body. This is part one of the video. Enjoy the video. So what do you need to put into your affiliate program agreement? The thing is, it's important to know, okay, what is an uh, affiliate uh, marketing program? We talked about it in a previous video. And we also talk about the structure of an agreement. So you have an agreement. And in an agreement, you have two parties, one and two. They have an agreement. And most time in an agreement, you have an intro. We talked about it in the previous video. And you have a body. And you have an outro. So in this video, we're going to talk about the body. Yeah, and then the outro. So keep in mind, we talked about it in the previous video. The body is really big. So we're going to divide it in three parts. And I'm not going to discuss every details about this agreement. I'm just going to show you how it works. If you want to download the template, you will find the link in the description. Go to that link and there on the link, you'll find instruction how you can download it. So technically the body, we're going to have, we have a part one, part two, and part three. Yeah. There are a lot of things that we can discuss, but I'm just going to focus on some things that you need to keep in mind. So this, technically this is the affiliate program agreement. Yeah. So if you look at the first thing, when you offer, when you offer an um, affiliate program, most times this is your company. You offer this to someone and you have this agreement, right? The thing is most of the time before they get an agreement, the person need to follow the requirements. If they have the, if they, if they meet the requirements, then they can get the agreement. But sometimes after they sign the agreement, you'll be like, Hey, um, I don't have a good feeling about you. I want to terminate the contract. Yeah, that's also possible. So if you look at this, you see in the first part, you can put some rules about the registration. How can you register for the affiliate program? And here they will talk about it. You see that in here, the, the requirements you can put it into and then approval or rejection. Here also the requirements you can put it into. See that? Here and here. And then you can debug. If someone gets rejected or after someone sign it, termination after settlement, you have the requirements in the contract. So keep in mind that sometimes you have some person, they sign up for an um, affiliate. And after a while, you'll be like, you know what? I want to terminate the contract. And here you can put some reason when you can terminate your contract because it's agreement between you and the person. Yeah. So this is technically how these two things work. Okay? And in this contract, they also talk about financial responsibility. Who's responsible for what? So let's say you have some, someone is doing the affiliate marketing for you and the financial of promoting your link or your product or services and all the other stuff is their responsibility, not yours. Keep that in mind. So it's their responsibility, not yours. And you need to make that clear in the contract. And that's how you see that here, financial responsibility. Yeah, see the recipient. So the person here is fully responsible for all the costs and expensive of maintaining and marketing the affiliate program. So that's something you need to be clear about that. It's not that you're going to sponsor them, help them get uh, money in order to promote the thing. That's not the uh, purpose of the affiliate, affiliate program. Keep that in mind. So technically, this is, this is how it works. And um, there are some things, for example, no representation about the product or services. Try to be clear when you have that. So if you have this template and you'd be like, okay, I want to put this in it, you can put it in it, but you need to be really clear about this, what they can and what they cannot do. Yeah. So if you have a question about it, what you can do is just go in the discord or in law center. You can ask me a question about this. And if you want this template, just go in the link in the description and there you can download it and then, um, meet me on the law center and then I can help you with your uh, program. And if you're not subscribed already, subscribe. See you in the next video.